Hi everybody, it's Miss McGregor here and it's my turn to do tonight's bedroom story. Now, the story I've chosen is We're All Wonders, which you might have heard it before um, or maybe even read it, but it's based on the novel uh, Wonder, which lots of you might have read or maybe you've even watched the movie. And it's quite a short story, but I think it's got a very important message. So, here we go. I know I'm not an ordinary kid. Sure, I do ordinary things. I ride a bike. I eat ice cream. I play ball. I just don't look ordinary. I don't look like other kids. My mum says I'm unique. She says I'm a wonder. My dog Daisy agrees. But some people don't see that I'm a wonder. All they see is how different I look. Sometimes they stare at me. They point or laugh. They even say mean things behind my back. But I can hear them. It hurts my feelings. It hurts Daisy's feelings too. When that happens, I put on my helmet I put Daisy's helmet on too. And then we blast off up, 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 up through the clouds. Across the galaxy. All the way to Pluto. We say hello to old friends. From far away, the earth looks so small. I can't see any people. But I know they're there. Billions of people. Billions of all different colours. People who walk and talk differently. People who look different. Like me. The earth is big enough for all kinds of people. I know I can't change the way I look. But maybe, just maybe, People can change the way they see me. If they do, they'll see that I'm a wonder. And they'll see that they're wonders too. We're all wonders. Look with kindness and you will always find wonder. And you're all wonders too. Good night, everybody.